I'm an observer. I see things happen every day. A short kid walks down the hallway as happy as he could be, when all of a sudden the taller, stronger, more outgoing people who thinks they're superior to him comes to pick on him. Now as he walks down the hallways, he doesn't seem so happy. Next to him walks a boy, a boy who got called the worst names just because he wore a pink shirt to school that day. Why in our society do people feel the need to judge one another? You and I are no different from those two kids who got picked on. If you look at it like this, if we were just our insides, our bones, and our muscles, they look no different. If that's all that we were, no skin, no clothes, no makeup, there would be nothing to beat. Even with these things present, we should act as if there's nothing to beat. Every adult that I know, and probably you too, will say, it's okay, don't be like them, be you, you're unique. And this is true for everybody, be unique. Dress the way you want to, listen to the music you love, and hang out with the people that you want to. Because despite outside differences, nobody has more worth than you do. When I first dyed my hair, it was terrifying. I was dyeing it bright red, like take the red that you're imagining and multiply it by like 20. I wasn't dyeing it because I wanted attention or because I wanted people to like me. I was dyeing it simply because I wanted to. And honestly, the first time that I saw it on myself, I fell in love with it. I was called an attention seeker. I was called goth or emo. Most people just flat out told me they didn't like it. Some people who told me these things thought that they were helping. Constructive criticism, right? They weren't. They were putting me down and they made me believe that my worth was less than theirs. Every person has different qualities. Someone may be a better singer than I am or a faster runner than me, but that does not change my value. Every, for, every person has worth. Every life has value. That person may accomplish more in life than I do or the, the other way around, but our value is no different, so don't make us think that it is. So I'm left here at the end of my eighth grade year and everybody I've met along the way has helped shape my beliefs and who I am. I am the same as you. I will not make you believe that I am better nor worse at living than you are, and that's because that I believe we are equal. Thank you.